This highlight package proudly presented by Coach Canada. The Peets look to extend their season with a win over Kingston in Game 4 on Thursday night at the PMC. The first goal of the game wasn't scored until 40.1 seconds to play in the second period, as rookie Steve Lorenz broke the ice with a long wraparound try. Just 1.55 into the third frame, Darcy Greenaway tipped the Polisado shot home to tie the game at 1. Andrew D'Agostini stood on his head again in the third period, making several exceptional saves. Just past the 10-minute mark in the third, Josh McDonald put the Pete's ahead again, burying a Greg Betzold rebound. And with the Kingston net empty, the Pete's put the game on ice as Hunter Garland scored an empty netter from Nick Ritchie to give the Pete's a 3-1 win. The series shifts to Kingston on Friday. Here are the post-game comments. You said uh, two days ago you guys would be back winning uh, game four, you right. Yeah, like I said, we were down, but we weren't out. You know, we played a full 60 minutes of hockey tonight, and uh, you know, we got some, uh, some guys stepped up at the right times and we won the game. So, obviously... We got some momentum going into tomorrow's game. You know, they're a little bit back on their heels, and uh, I think we can come back and do this in seven. You're starting to really like the playoffs. You got two tallies in two games. Yeah, you know, I like to fall through the playoffs. You know, obviously it's a big time of the year, not only individually but as a team. And you know, I think uh, we can go far. Um, we're a tough team to play against, and we're on our game, and we just got to keep rolling. Our backs are against the wall here, so um, you know, do or die game. You just got to give your team a chance to win, and. Uh, and that's what I did. So it was it was nice to put one away there in the third period, and, and an empty netter always always feels good. So um, the series, hopefully, the momentum is shifted, and we need another effort like that tomorrow. You guys don't catch any breaks. The bounces seem to go their way. The ref calls go their way. The injuries, you know, go their way, and then you guys just keep moving along. Well, that's what makes a win like this that much sweeter. Is uh, when everything seems to be going against you, and you still pull it off. So. Uh, hopefully that that character that we uh, we showed tonight will transfer over till tomorrow. And uh, like I said, we just we need to stay consistent like we were tonight for 60 minutes. Yeah, I think and you know I thought we, we battled hard and you know for the most part of game one, two, and three it was just uh, tonight for whatever reason there was just that little little extra and you know we were able to increase our level of battle as the game went on. I thought. And, you know, especially when you're missing a couple, you know, important pieces to your uh, entire puzzle. It, uh, you know, it was just a solid effort by our guys. What what stood out to you tonight about the effort? Just we, you know, we stuck to the game plan. Uh, you know, we just we kept going. You know, even when you questioned something, the guys just kept going. Like there was no stopping them, regardless of you know maybe a call on the ice or an icing or an offside or something. They just they just kept going. They didn't, uh, you know, they didn't let up. Uh, that Kingston team doesn't let up either, do they? No, they don't. And again, I've said since game one, they're a, they're a skilled team. They, you know, they play a fast game, and you know, we got some timely saves from Andrew who kept us in the game. And you know, again, that's all you want from your goaltending. You have to believe. The minute you stop believing, is the minute you're done. And. We haven't stopped. We didn't stop yesterday in practice, and we didn't stop today when we were at the rink and when the guys got here for game time. They didn't stop. And, uh, you know, it's going to be no different uh, tomorrow. It's a new day tomorrow, and we've got to refocus. Uh, you know, starting tonight, even I told me you got to refocus, enjoy it for a bit, but you got to refocus and get your mind back on uh, on the task at hand.